Well, a petition is running on change.org. It's been signed by more than 200,000 people saying choose one time and stick with it year round. It also mentions that states, including Maine, have proposed making daylight saving time permanent. So let's break down why simply eliminating the clock change isn't so easy nationwide. The time zones are big. The extreme eastern point of the eastern time zone is Lubeck here in Maine. The western point up on the UP of Michigan. So take on Tunaga, Michigan, for example. It's latest sunrise in the winter, 842 in the morning. Latest sunset in the summer there, nearly 10 p.m. For us on the eastern end here in Maine, the earliest sunset more of a problem, 346 p.m. in the winter in Lubeck and in the summer the earliest sunrise about 20 minutes before five. Say in theory we don't fall back. All of the eastern time zone stays on daylight saving year round. In Maine, the earliest sunset now becomes a more manageable 446 p.m., giving us an extra hour of daylight on winter afternoons. But in Ontunigan, the latest sunrise becomes a brutal 942 in the morning. That shows it's complicated for the whole time zone. One proposal in Maine and New Hampshire, though, is moving our states to Atlantic Standard Time, basically staying on daylight saving time year round, meaning more daylight on winter afternoons. So what do you think? We'll keep it simple. Should we stop changing the clocks and stay on daylight saving time? You can go to my Instagram at Ryan Breton WX. I posted a poll on my story there. Yes has been strongly in the running. You can also join the conversation on the News Center Maine Facebook page. The debate is definitely one that will rage on. I'm meteorologist Ryan Breton, News Center, Maine.